News 2 I-Team Investigation. This week, the town of Mount Pleasant approved a measure with the hope of saving police officers' lives. Police there will now carry Narcan. That's a medication administered when someone overdoses. Officers are dealing with these powerful drugs, and there have been deaths from accidental exposure. News 2's investigator Rebecca Collette explains the trend. From a routine traffic stop to medical emergencies in a person's home, he just shot himself. officers are confronted with deadly so. drugs. The, the strains that are out there now can, um, can actually kill an officer by just touching it or ingesting it. That's why Mount Pleasant Chief of Police Carl Ritchie says the town approved police to carry nasal spray Narcan. It's important for the officers to have the Narcan actually on their person so they can imme immediately administer their own antidote to themselves. The town is following a movement happening across the country. Franklin County, Mississippi officers were trained to use it last month. For an officer who makes a routine stop realizes that there may be narcotics in the car. They do a search. They get it on their hands, it absorbs through their skin, and within a matter of just a few minutes, they could go into overdose. Horry County introduced the medication this summer. Hartsville officers were trained in August. It's really important for our officers to have something uh, that if they get exposed or a fireman gets exposed or, a, or an ambulance worker gets exposed, uh, to enable them to counteract the effects of the drug. According to DHEC, more than 3,000 police are trained to administer Narcan, and there have been 87 documented lives saved by officers across the state. No, the paramedics are coming, but we'll be able to administer to save that life as well. Making implementing it a no brainer. Rebecca Clutt, News 2. If you have something you want the I team to investigate, simply email us at iteam at wcbd.com or call 843 216 4949. That is